the Joe Rogan experience. Yeah. There's two things that I want to talk to you about before we got in here besides the election, in no particular order. Aliens and George Soros. <laughs> hey, those, how do you know they're not connected? They might be connected. They might be connected. But, <laughs> but both of those things I find um, particularly fascinating. I never knew that about you. The, the George Soros thing just keeps coming up over and over and over again where people that I know that are very intelligent and some that are very connected mm -hmm. – say that he's funding a lot of these Antifa rallies and protests and and chaos and that they're uh, funding the political campaigns of people that are opposed to putting people in jail and that are promoting, air quotes, social justice mm -hmm. and all of these reforms and all of these political movements that seem to be deteriorating uh, the, the the trust in law enforcement and that there's some sort of organized campaign by him to mm -hmm. do something to destroy the, fag the fabric of our democracy. Yeah, sort of the one world government run by George Soros. That's um, the Batman villain yeah. storyline. Yeah, right? I, I, I think uh, the truth is, is less uh, exciting or interesting. Uh, I think he's, 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 he puts a lot of money into a, a handful of organizations and that money gets uh, funneled out for various purposes, campaigns, uh, supporting um, organizations. There's no doubt. I think that that uh, um, he his worldview is is somewhat different than than, than mine. Um, but I don't think that Soros is uh, you know running some uh, campaign to take down America. I think that's why do you think of... people are so attracted to that idea? Is it because of Batman movies? Yeah, you know everybody loves a big villain. He's an yeah. evil looking guy. I mean, I again, hey, I don't mean that wrong, but you Not, know he can't help no his offense. appearance. No offense, there. But you look yeah. like you could be in Star Wars. Yeah, I mean, <laughs> he's yeah, he's got, <laughs> he's got that look about him. You can see yeah. him in a black robe. Yeah, uh, well, Vader, exactly. You know Takes your the directive. Helmet off, and you know, dun, hey, dun, just look at that. Dun, 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 dun. He could do something about those bags under his eyes, frankly. Mm. But he doesn't want to. He's got billions of dollars. Yeah, I know. What gets a person's rocks off when they have that much money and they're, you know, they're still trying to make more money and they're basically, I mean, how old is he? 80? How old is George Soros? He's got to be in his 80s, right? He's he's in the home 90. stretch. 90. He's 90. 90. 90. 90. Yeah. He's in the home stretch, kids. Does it say how much money he's given away of his? Uh, it says he's worth eight point six billion. I don't know about giving away. <laughs> he's not giving any. Uh, having he's... donated more than thirty two billion to the Open Society Foundation, according go. to Wikipedia. Wow, he's worth yeah. eight. He's donated thirty two. That's a man committed. <laughs> yeah, and see, that's part of it. That's the, this, crazy. The connection to Open Society, I think, is probably what helps to fuel it. But and, and, I mean, you got a guy that. What does know, that mean? He's an oil, easy. Fo uh, what do you call it? Uh, he's an easy. Um, he's an easy foil, an easy target to be. Um, in I mean, it's like the Koch brothers. There's no difference, right? It's just one side blames the Koch brothers for, right. you know, uh, trying to take over America, and, and one side blames Soros. So, what is I, that organization, Jamie? Open Society. Oh, open the Open Society Foundation support individuals and organizations across the globe fighting for freedom of expression, accountable government, and societies that promote justice and equality. Well, that sounds good. It does sound That's good, doesn't it? That's what's confusing. Yeah. Uh, so all these people that think he's evil. Truth and justice. I mean, but if I was going to be evil, I would hide behind something like that. It yeah. sounds like a perfect Well, and you can imagine some of that cover. money getting eventually funneled, making its way to organizations. I'm not saying it's happening, but an organization like Antifa or whatever. Right. Uh, you know the 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 theory being oh no we're trying to promote you know if you if you wrap yourself in the cloak of promoting equality and justice most people aren't going to push back because they don't want to look like a dick right right you can get so, away with a lot of shit yeah so you don't you don't you know but I, anybody who's got <laughs> this like this is uh, one of my things if you're going to give money to an organization you know do a little investigating first find out how much of it goes into people's pockets and and actually where the money goes and what it's used for. Sometimes it's easier than not, and if it's difficult to find that information out, give your money somewhere else, right? Because it's not there should be transparency around any any operation that's asking you for a donation or for your money. But Soros, you know, when he funnels that money and makes its way through, it's like a pachinko machine, right? It's kind of it's just kicking all over the place, mm -hmm. right? And so it's it's no surprise. But um, so do you think it's just that it's an easy uh, target? for someone who's looking for like one person who's the puppet master who's pulling all the strings right everybody loves 
it's a simplistic way of looking at things, yeah. right? And I'm not saying that Soros isn't funding groups that wouldn't piss people off, I guess, but, uh, you know... I, there's more to it. There's than more that. to it than that. But episodes of the Joe Rogan Experience are now free on Spotify. That's right. They're free from September 1st to December 1st. They're going to be available everywhere. But after December 1st, they will only be available on Spotify, but they will be free. That includes the video. The video will also be there. It'll also be free. That's all we're asking. Just go download Spotify. Much love. Bye-bye. Mm.